Sam's new flying battleship, the biggest ever built, is rolled out for a final ground checkup. The B-19 weighs 82 tons, twice the size of a transatlantic clipper. Tires eight feet high were deflated to get her out of the hangar. The aerial monster has a wingspan of 212 feet. It's a long way back here. The Army's test pilot, Major Umstead, will give the word when she's ready to take to the air. B-19's runner is 44 yards long and is higher than a three-story building. Today, she's just getting used to the airfield. And when they take her aloft, an $82,000 insurance premium will cover her first 60 seconds in the air. An historic chapter in the annals of aviation opens at Santa Monica with the launching of the world's mightiest wonder bomber, the B-19. For its maiden trip, there are crack army pilots at the controls. The 42 feet high rudder is equivalent to a three-story building, and it's the business end of a deadly cannon. A hundred thousand letters will be specially marked to celebrate the historic hop, and stamp collectors will have a rare field day. Limbering up the engine, that's the climax of four years of steady experimental work. A thousand horsepower is let loose as she takes off. Three and a half million dollars worth of laboratory and factory development. With a full load, she can carry 28 tons of bombs and range over 7,000 miles. The 82-ton monster, the most powerful flyer the world has ever known, spreads her 212 feet of wings over March Field, ready for a landing. Test pilot Major Rumstead and his giant plane come through with flying colors. America can be proud of the B-19. Come for a stroll along the wing before we go aloft in Uncle Sam's 8,000 horsepower B-19. Dwarfing everything else on the aerodrome at Marchfield, California, the 82-ton Colossus of the Air takes off. The interior of the biggest bombing plane in the world is like the bridge of a warship. The power control cabin has a crew to itself, while the radio operator is housed in positive luxury. Compare her size with the escort planes. In the forward turret, the bomb aimer controls the destiny of 28 tons of bombs. And that's quite a lot of upstuff. Now let's travel to Baltimore. <laughs> 